I'm at the house at 7506 Rustic Trail in the Ventura subdivision. I'm going to give you a 360 the neighborhood here. This house is on a cul-de-sac. This will be the condition of the home as of the date of this video, which is December 11th, 2015, about 12.30 in the afternoon. This subdivision is near shopping. It's close to Loop 410, I-10, 35, and 1604, so it's kind of in the middle of all those freeways. Also, it's close to uh, Randolph Air Force Base and Fort Sam Houston. So it's a very good location. The house itself, well, first of all, we got a uh, two-car, probably a four-car carport here. Two-car garage with a garage door opener and does have epoxy uh, coating on the floors. So you have a lot of room here for parking. The house itself is a three-bedroom, two-bath. Square footage is roughly 1,922 square feet. Take a look inside the home. We got four sides brick on this home. We'll do a quick layout here of the floor plan before we walk it. To my immediate right is the dining room. Uh, that'll be the doorway to the kitchen. Straight ahead here will be the living room. Breakfast nook will be to the right side. Staircase to the second floor. And then to my uh, left will be the access to the laundry room and then the master bedroom, which is downstairs. So right here in the front, uh, we got nice neutral colors throughout the home. We have ceiling fans and blinds throughout the home. Also got a security system here. So we had nice tile floors throughout the first floor except for the master bedroom. Very large dining room space. Or you can, you can use half of it as dining room and half of it as another living space. Here we have nice uh, 11 foot ceiling here in the living room. We got a uh, gas fireplace. It is wood burning. Very nice neutral colors here. This area here is the breakfast nook. You can you do your informal dining here. We've got updated kitchen here, the uh, granite countertops, which is very nice. Uh, we also have granite in the bath, as you'll see in a minute. So we have the stove, built-in microwave. We got the French doors on the um, fridge with the freezer on the bottom. Dishwasher, dual sinks. Right here off of the kitchen, we have access to the backyard. We have a nice covered patio. The lot size is 0.18, so it's a very large lot. Got a privacy fence there, storage shed, and another patio for the access from the master bedroom. So, good size yard, lots of space for entertaining. Okay. And the left here we have the utility room. That's the door to the two car garage with opener. Washer and dryer hookups. Now as we go to the masters, this is the bathroom that can be used for the downstairs uh, guests. And also you can close off that door to just have it as your master bathroom. So we have the nice granite countertops here. Tile shower enclosure, and uh, tub and shower combination here. And that's the door you would close off to make that part of your master bathroom. Here we have the master bedroom. Let me just walk in a corner here so you can see the uh, size of it. It's about 20 feet long by about 11 feet across, so it is a huge master bedroom. Uh, definitely room to put your king size bed, dresser, nightstands, etc. Right here we have a good size walk-in closet. Shelf space and hanging space. Then off of you have your French doors here leading to your own patio. So 
So here you have the patio space and again a nice good size backyard. Then we're going to head upstairs where we have uh, the loft and two additional bedrooms. Okay, on the immediate left will be bedroom number two. We have right here bedroom number three, the loft space, and to my right is the upstairs bathroom. So we'll start here. We got granite countertops here again that matches the rest of the house. Tile floors, nice sitting space there. And then you have your commode and your tub and shower combination. This is the second bedroom. This is the larger of the two upstairs bedrooms. About uh, 13 feet by 12 feet, so it's a good sized bedroom. Ceiling fan in all the bedrooms. And then there's your closet space. So let me just back up so we get a little bit better perspective on the size here. It's a very good size. All right, bedroom number three, about 12 feet by 11 feet. It's also still a good sized bedroom. You can get its own ceiling fan and a similar closet. And then a good sized loft area here. So you can use this as your upstairs game area or an office. Got some shelves here and you get your own ceiling fan. So this is a very nice home. If you'd like more information about this home or like to schedule a showing, my name is Mark Fee. My cell number is 210-618-9161. Or you can call the office at Liberty Management, 210-681-8080. Thank you.